Hi, I'm Kale Anonymous, and welcome to Kingston's Indie Hack. Oh God! Holy shit! <laughs> On today's episode of Indie Hack, we'll be showing you how to get the best GoPro action shots on your bike. If you're like me, then you love danger and the thrill of cycling through sick trails. And there's no better way to capture all your exploits than with a GoPro. But before you can start shooting, you're going to need a good camera mount. So for our first hack, we're gonna show you how to build a cheap but sturdy GoPro mount for your bike using things you probably have lying around your garage. We're calling this one the bottle cap mount. To get started, you're gonna need the following items. First, cut out the top of the bottle and wrap it around your bike's handlebar. Then cut two slits on each side of the bottle to run the zip tie through. Now drill a quarter inch hole through the bottle cap and put the screw through the hole. Then tighten with the nut and rubber washer. Connect your GoPro by screwing the tripod mount onto the bottle cap. For a sturdier grip, glue the screw to the bottle cap. Finally, twist the cap onto the bottle top and you're done. But before you begin shooting, remember to load up your GoPro with reliable memory like the new Kingston SDCAC built specifically for action cams. Once that's done, turn on your GoPro and you're ready to go. So now you're asking, Kale, these are great GoPro mounts for my handlebar, but what if I wanna mount my GoPro elsewhere on my bike? Well, I'm glad you asked, we've got a hack for that too. We call this one the frame mount. Here's the supply list. First, mark out a section on the side of the PVC tee about a half an inch to an inch tall, depending on your bike frame. Sand or shave off any rough areas left after cutting. Now drill four holes for each piece, one in each corner, and make sure they're large enough to fit zip ties through. Cut sheets of rubber small enough to fit the underside of each piece of the PVC tee. Glue the sheets to the bottom of the pieces. After the glue dries, puncture through the rubber pads to expose the holes in the PVC. Now feed your zip ties through the holes. Next, drill a quarter inch hole through the PVC plug. Put the screw through the PVC with the nut inside and screw the head poking outside. Tighten the nut and affix the rubber washer to the top of the plug. You can also glue it in place for extra durability. Now find a spot on your bike frame to attach the mount. Use the top and bottom zip ties to secure the frames. Attach the tripod mount to the screw head sticking out of the PVC pipe and you're done. Try out various spots on your bike frame and add a 90 degree PVC elbow for more creative angles. It broke. So now you got GoPro mounts for your handlebars and just about anywhere else on your bike. But this next hack is gonna allow you to shoot video with a third person POV. That's right, we're going GTA on this one. I give you the third person backpack mount. The first step is to create a PVC cross rig to fit in your backpack. This rig will serve as a steady holder for your camera mount. Start by cutting up the PVC pipe into various pieces to form a cross that will fit in your backpack. These are the lengths we used in our backpack. Once that's done, connect the nine inch pipe piece to the top of your cross with the 90 degree PVC elbow. This will serve as your arm bar for your GoPro. To attach your GoPro, start by drilling a hole in the end of the arm bar piece. Insert the screw through the bottom and secure it with the nut on the other side, then add the washer. Now attach the GoPro tripod mount to the tip of the screw and you're done. Test out your rig with your GoPro, making sure the arm bar is long enough to shoot past your shoulder. Once you're happy with your view, you can glue it together to permanently bond your rig. And as an added bonus, you can paint it your favorite color to give your rig a cool, customized look. Now for a truly cool and unique POV for your bike trekking. We have another hack for you hardcore DIYers. We're calling this hack the 360 Helmet Cam. Start by cutting out a three foot piece of PVC pipe then drill a quarter inch hole through one end of the pipe. Screw in the tripod mount through the hole and attach the GoPro facing away from the pipe. Then take your pipe, find the center, and drill a quarter inch hole straight through the middle, but perpendicular to how your GoPro is hanging. Take the swivel caster and attach it to the center of the pipe where you just drilled the hole. Then attach the pipe to the helmet using zip ties. Now you'll need to create a counterweight for the GoPro. On the other end of the pipe, attach the quarter inch washers between 25 and 30, depending on the weight of your GoPro, with the hex bolt and nut. Test out the counterweight to make sure it balances out your GoPro. Once it's balanced, glue the washers together for added security, and you're done. You now have a 360 helmet cam. 
All right, folks, that's our episode on GoPro action shots for the bike. With just a few cheap items, you can create some very cool GoPro mounts for your bike and get awesome video of your riding. So get out there, try them out, have fun, and above all, be safe. And remember to subscribe to our channel for future Indie Hack episodes. Catch you guys later. Start me up, Herb. Let's go. Woo!